Alright, what is up guys? Chino Man 1129 here bringing you uh, some Gears of War 3 gameplay. Um, originally, I had uh, planned to um, put up some Catherine. Um, I was trying to go for a top uh, top 10 leaderboard run of uh, the third stage of Babel, uh, Obelisk. Uh, but sadly, that didn't go out. That didn't go uh, quite as planned. Um, I screwed up so many times. Uh, I almost reached near the end, but. It, uh, the stage just f uh, kept falling, and I don't know how I got backpack there. It was, that was that was fucked up. Um, so yeah, um, so I scrapped the Catherine uh, gameplay and uh, decided to do, um, just uh, look for a substantial uh, length uh, gears uh, video that I recorded, uh, some gears gameplay video that I recorded uh, about a month ago. Um, so yeah, uh, this game started um, pretty badly, um, we lost the first round, I don't know how, um, I think we screwed up uh, quite a bit, uh, I want to say it's kind of like my fault I guess, uh, I don't know, maybe, um, but we uh, picked it back up, uh, second round, uh, we did pretty, uh, pretty. Uh, we took it pretty convincingly, and um, third round. Um, it was a little uh, hard fought, but in the end, um, we eventually got it. <clears throat> uh. So yeah, um, nothing special about this gameplay. Um, I just did a few torque kills. Um, a few nice torque kills, I guess. Not really nice at all. And um, uh, going a little streak, uh, just a really small streak uh, with the sniper. So yeah. Um, but this video, um, not gonna talk, commentate about the gameplay that much. But um, what I'm gonna talk about is um, not really talk, but not really talk about. But um, I'm gonna rant. Yes, rant. I love ranting. Um, uh, vents out my frustration or whatever. Um, but yeah, um, today uh, is November seventh, uh, two thousand eleven. Uh, and today is the day that um, pretty much uh, every kid ages, I guess, 12 to maybe 18, I don't know, um, will be uh, abandoning every game they own in place of Modern Warfare 3. And in the process, they will skip school just to play Modern Warfare 3. Yeah. Big fun, big fun. Um, Mainly big fun for me because um, all the terrible players from games like, um, of course, Gears of War three and uh, Battlefield three um, will leave um, will leave those games um, to go play that shitty map pack, shitty sixty dollar map pack. Yes, I said map pack because honestly, if you look at it at an analytical point of view, every single Call of Duty game after Part four has just been a map pack. I mean, um, it's just a map pack with slight tweaks. Uh, slight tweaks being um, new weapons that are pretty much just cosmetic, and um, and perks that people will eventually um, get angry at. I mean, uh, look at part four. Uh, not many people like martyrdom. So, but I think was it Captain Blood War? Uh, I'm not too sure, um, but yeah, um, they kept that perk, oh, then they decided to scrap that, put it as a death streak in Modern Warfare 2, in Black Ops it's pretty much not apparent, but um, people had problems with Ghost and shit, uh, also in Modern Warfare 2 they had problems with One Man Army, Danger Close, uh, Commando, all that stupid shit, um, I don't know how Modern Warfare 3 uh, will fare, I have, I have hardly taken an interest in that game. I haven't researched uh, too much into it at all. I've just only seen a few um, gameplay videos. Uh, nothing has caught my attention wholeheartedly. I mean, um, like honestly, uh, honestly, I thought I thought I would be getting it. I thought I would be getting Modern Warfare 3, um, but turns out, uh, came to my senses is just like really nothing special at all. Um, I'm not going to be spending sixty dollars on a on a, on a low production game, um, and I mean it. It's really, really low production. I mean, 
used to a weapon. Nothing's changed. Like I said, it's just um, same game with minor tweaks. Wow. <sighs> what else? What else? What else? Uh, what the fuck? Read around here <laughs> while you guys look around the at the gameplay. Oh my! They got two awesome up. gameplay. And I'm saying that really sarcastically. Um, let's see what other people have had to say uh, about um, their hate towards Call of Duty. Uh, Last one. So here. One respawn. Okay, this guy says about Call of Duty in the forum, um, says uh, that the multiplayer has a horrendous community filled with people who are willing to do anything to keep their to keep their kill death ratio up. Um, I can vouch for that. I can honestly vouch for that. Um, back then, uh, when I played Black Ops for the first uh, couple of months, um, I pretty much just focused on my kill death ratio. Uh, sometimes I would focus on the objective, but um, uh, mainly I go for a high uh, high kill death ratio uh, per game. I think before I sold it, um, I ended up with like maybe like. A 2.8, 2 2.8 kill death ratio, and like pretty much a 15 win loss ratio. I'm not sure, not too entirely, sh not too entirely sure, but uh, yeah. Um, uh, he also adds um, the whole map pack thing is a joke. There's crap balance, yes there is, and the heavy multiplayer focus in general has made them just ignore the single player section. That's pretty much true. Um, they release a new game every year and they've exhausted their ideas a long time ago. So, yeah. Pretty, and he adds um, pretty much the, the multiplayer community of that game. It's wholly composed of shouting, screaming obs obscenities. Obscenities, I don't know how to pronounce it. I don't know what's the uh, correct pronunciation. But And, and disproportionately loud explosions that have worked. Oh. oh. Whoa. Uh, I don't know. Um, but yeah. Uh, but yeah, that's what pretty much the community uh, is uh, um, is comprised of. Uh, they were that right? I think I did. But yeah. Um, community is just filled with um, pretty much kids who. Um, have no understanding of um, the video game world. Uh, honestly, they don't. Um, I've, I've, I have, I do have some uh, uh, younger people uh, in my Xbox I have a friends list. Um, they play COD a lot. Um, they enjoy it. Uh, sometimes the, um, they'll pick up a a pretty good game um, like Gear, like Gears of War. Um, uh, um, some RPGs like Fallout, or whatever. Um, uh, that keep uh, that keeps them interested. Um, but honestly, all they like multiplayer-wise, all they ever do is pretty much just play Call of Duty. Um, and it sucks for me too because um, uh, I was an avid COD player, and um, back then uh, I just uh, gathered up uh, people on my friends list. Or not gathered up. Um, people of my wait, gathered up. Wait, no, uh, my bad. Um, back then, um, like when I was still a cop, uh, Call of Duty player, Call of Duty player. Yeah, uh, I don't know if I'm speaking too fast. Uh, but um, yeah, back then uh, when I was an avid uh, Call of Duty player, um, I eventually found a clan uh, that pretty much focused on uh, on uh, Call of Duty. Well. I guess not focus, but um, I don't want to be mean, but that's pretty much all uh, the clan could play. I mean, uh, all they did, all we pretty much did was just play Call of Duty, um, I guess competitively, competitively, my bad. Um, I, I've played uh, Halo and Gears of War with them um, in some matches, um, but uh, people just don't play those games as much. I mean, uh, their main like, the clan the clan's main focus was Call of Duty. Um, so that's pretty much um, uh, one of the reasons why I just left. 
I mean, it's just a stale game. Uh, period. Yeah, oh shit. Uh, did my water drip on my keyboard? Uh, I don't think so. But, so yeah, that's pretty much how it is. Um, take another look at one, uh, another person's rant about Call of Duty. Um, this guy says, um, I hate Call of Duty because it's an uninspired real-life war simulator. It attempts realistic war scenarios, and I just find that premise incredibly boring. The games come out far too often, and it's all I hear anyone ever talk about, ever. I openly hate on these games, and I still get the occasional game invites from my friends that got sucked into this garbage series. Ugh. I found the gameplay stagnant at best, and I generally dislike how pushy a majority of its fans are. Um, this dude puts in parentheses, it's like a sin against God if you tell someone you don't like Call of Duty. Uh, yeah, uh, he's pretty much telling the truth. <coughs> like, uh, let's see here, looking back at it, um, yeah, like, one of my, one of my, uh, one of my good friends, he recently got into Call of Duty, um, Black Ops, uh, unfortunately. And he was, he's been addicted to zombies, uh, the zombie mode, ever since uh, he got a hold of it. Like, uh, I remember back then, um, uh, a while back, um, when I saw one of his, when I saw one of his posts on Facebook, he was like, uh, see here, how do I read this right? Or let's see if I can remember it. Oh, yeah, I have a hard time remembering stuff, so bear with me. Oh man, I'm gonna save your ass. Ah, what was it? What was it? What was it? Oh, yeah. Um. Ah, I'm still trying to worry. Uh, probably. Uh, okay, I got it. I got it. I got it now. Yeah. Um. Pretty much, he put as his status. Um. Like. Uh. I'm just paraphrasing here, so yeah. Uh. He pretty much put that. Um. He was really getting uh, bored uh, of his class at the time and he just wanted to go back home and play zombies that to me is just pretty much sad um, sad in the fact that um, he wants to um, get out of class ASAP just to play a mode that's okay at best but eventually gets boring I mean zombies is fun I'm not gonna lie but uh, it does get boring after a while. I mean, there's really nothing to gain. Uh, well, I don't. Know, I don't want to say nothing to gain. It's just like there's no um, substantial achievement in it. I guess. I guess uh, you could say that. But yeah. Speaking of zombies, ah, oh, those map packs. Well, that's the. That's one of the reasons why I'm just like um, avoiding Call of Duty. The overpriced map packs. I know it's not Activision, well maybe it is Activision, I don't know. Maybe it's Activision and Microsoft, maybe. Anyway, it's just, those two bastards, they just overpriced, um, they give us, like, three, four maps for 15 bucks? I mean, really? Come on. Um, I remember back then, uh, uh, what was it? Uh, I think, uh, no wait, was it 2008? Or, was it? Yeah, it was 2009, 2009. Um, back then, uh, when uh, Gears of War 2 was uh, still being uh, was still being played by me, um, released, uh, was it 20? Um, 20 map, map pack, I think? But yeah, they released this uh, thing called the All Fronts Collection. It, it uh, pretty much had every single map, uh, downloadable map uh, for Gears of War 2. Plus uh, a campaign, a, a short uh, uh, director's cut of the campaign uh, for twenty bucks. That to me is a deal. That's that's a deal breaker. But with Call of Duty, um, they give us five, four maps just for fifteen bucks. I'm not, I'm not getting my money's worth with that. I mean, honestly, I'm not. Um, so yeah. Fuck the map packs for Call of Duty. Fuck Call of Duty in general. In general. So yeah. Ugh, let's see.
Go into another person's rant. Alright. Alright, this dude says, Call of Duty's been boring and stale for years now. He's telling the truth. Uh, this year won't be any different. Uh, scroll down a bit. The only people excited about Modern Warfare 3 this year are those people who play Call of Duty exclusively and I want to add excessively the entire year and children. Yes, children. We love children, don't we? <laughs> uh, there are way too many AAA games this year. Um, AAA games like Skyrim, uh, Arkham City, Gears of War 3, uh, Battlefield 3, and what else? Uh, that's pretty much all I could think of for, uh, for this year. Um, well, for the, um, for like the fall, uh, or the fourth quarter of this year. But yeah, um, there are way too many AAA games this year to even think about wasting my time playing Call of Duty with a bunch of raging children. Um, back to the topic of um, children in Call of Duty. Um, uh, I want to say, when I say children, um, uh, in this video, um, I'm talking about people age around maybe, like uh, what I said earlier, around 12 to probably 18, I guess. Um, but that. I just don't want to be playing um, a game that has that um, that whose uh, community is consi is consisted uh, in that age group. Um, some people um, like rarely do I find a mature person uh, who plays that game and and doesn't rage about it uh, every single uh, second or or talks about it or. Uh, pretty much every single second. Um, what also saddens me is um, uh, what else saddens me about Call of Duty and children. Uh, I don't know. I just I don't know. Uh, oh yeah. Um, yeah. There. Oh um, no no. What saddens me about Call of Duty and children is that. They're just pretty much blind to um, what they're really playing. Um, uh, they don't realize they're playing just the same game um, every year. Um, I don't know why they're wet over a sixty-dollar uh, map pack with, like I said, um, with little. Uh, with little tweaks. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? Uh, yeah, back in uh, back in Mono for two in the Mono for two days, um, uh, people would just snipe like every lobby, every single damn lobby. Well, not every single damn lobby, but um, almost every lobby uh, I was in. People were just sniping the whole fucking time. It was annoying. I mean, um, you people, uh, you'd see people running gun with the sniper. Um, they do stupid 360, 720, wall bang, trick shot bullshit. I don't know what the fuck these terms are. Um, or why it's even cool. I mean, honestly, it's just, you're just turning around and just shooting someone. I mean, is that really impressive is it is it really i mean what are you going to gain from it what are you what are you going to gain from it um and that's the thing also um people try to, people try to be flashy or yeah but yeah people try to be f uh, as flashy as they can in call of duty uh just to try to attain youtube status and try to make a living out of youtube which is sad to me it is sad to me <sighs> so, in the end, will I be getting Modern Warfare 3? I don't know if I uh, answered that, but will I? No, I won't. I'm not going to deal with uh, bullshit that happens every year and get bored of it. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, be sure to subscribe, rate, leave a comment, like it, and I'll talk to you guys later. See you.